Hello, I am uh, Dr. Ritu Trivedi from uh, Central Drug Research Institute and I am taking this opportunity to share with you a an, an very interesting um, research and uh, this is with uh, Spinacea oleracea or Palak um, uh, which is commonly known as and uh, this is uh, in the area of uh, osteoarthritis. Now osteoarthritis is a disease that is of the joints wherein uh, you have uh, swelling in the joints, you have uh, movement walking is very difficult when you have osteoarthritis and then it, it is then that we come to know uh, that we've got osteoarthritis but surprisingly uh, there is no treatment whatsoever available for osteoarthritis even till date whatever is there is uh, either the painkillers which you cannot take for a very very uh, long time they have several side effects because of which you cannot take them for a long time but as of preserving your uh, knee joint or taking care of the cartilage of of which these joints are made up of uh, you we have no medicine so uh, 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 while working in cdri we observed that Spinacea oleracea has a special ability to form more and more of cartilage cells and in true sense to say that it helps in proliferating more and more of cartilage cells. Now this was very interesting to us because we thought that this could be very useful in a disease like osteoarthritis where the joints are made up of uh, cartilage cells. So the experiments that were performed in the joints in which osteoarthritis was created and when Spinacea oleracea was given, we found that it stopped the, uh, uh, the degeneration and it stopped the destruction of the cartilage cells at that point of time. Now this was checked experimentally by various methods by micro CT, by an x-ray, gene expression studies and also clinical biomarkers. So you, we have two markers that are commonly used. The CTX marker which is um, uh, which shows that how much collagen is being secreted out in the urine. This is a urinary marker. So the more the CTX2 you have in the urine, it shows that there is a lot of destruction happening. And when Spinacea oleracea is given, we find that the CTX2 level, uh, levels go down. On the other hand, we have the formation marker, which is known as the COMP, which is a serum marker. And if you have higher levels of a COMP, it shows that the cartilage is being formed and there is lesser destruction um, happening at the joints. So not only was uh, Spinacea, Spinacea oleracea helpful for the cartilage cells but in the behavioral experiments we also found that it improved the uh, locomotion um, and helped in uh, uh, walking better and relieved from a lot of pain also. So um, as you know that uh, uh, this is a very very good finding not only for men and women but especially for the women because osteoporotic women are more and more prone, uh, prone for osteoarthritic uh, kind of effects and so the, this entire technology was given to uh, Farmenza uh, Herbals Private Limited and then it is a marketing partner Arian Labs Private Limited who's marketing it and Dr. Sanjeev Agarwal is the director of the um, of Arian Labs and uh, not only is he the director but he's also an orthopedician so he understands much much better that it is what an important finding it is and it is going to be helpful for so many uh, people around in India. So this has been marketed by the name of Joint Fresh um, uh, in India and uh, this is a question that comes to me very often that uh, from where do we get it and how long do we have to take joint fresh. So first you can get it all over India in a lot of medical stores or it is available online on long live lives and also on uh, Amazon and how long do you have to take it all depends on how much destruction has happened in your joints. So if it is too much of destruction obviously you have to take it for a longer longer time but if it is just an initiation where you see a little bit of swelling or it is you have uh, difficulty in walk, walking here and there then you can immediately uh, start joint fresh and I'm sure you have to take joint fresh for a smaller period of time. So these knee joints have been gifted to us for 100 years so it is our duty and our responsibility to take care of these joints for a uh, um, for hundred years as lo or as long as we live, but suppose we have any problems whatsoever, then Joint Fresh is there to help you. Thank you.